Good day to you all. Che Mando here. Today I'll be talking to you about my top five anticipated movies of 2015. This year looks like it's going to be a great year for movies and us film buffs like myself and maybe yourself watching. It looks like there's going to be some great movies. You've got your animated movies and you've got your live action movies. They all look absolutely great this year. Right to start off my list, we've got John Wick. And seeing the trailer for this, I couldn't believe that Keanu Reeves is making a film like this. After the Matrix trilogy, I didn't think he was going to make a film that would redeem him from that. Matrix, I did not like personally. You may have liked it, I didn't. But John Wick, it looks like it could redeem him from what I see as what destroyed him as an actor to me personally. Then we've got Chappie. I've only seen one trailer on this, and it does look like a nice, cute movie. I'm not too sure how it's going to go, but it kind of feels a bit to me a bit Wally meets uh, Short Circuits, Johnny Five. Yeah, it looks like it could be a quite an interesting film. Then we've got Avengers 2 Age of Ultron. Now, those trailers, when they came out, absolutely amazing. You've got all the cast from the Avengers. You bring in James Spade in as Ultron. Absolutely great. Uh, you've also got, they're introducing Quicksilver and Scarlet Witch. But I'm not sure how they are going to go in the film. Because <clears throat> in the comic books and the cartoon universe... They are the father and they know they are the son and daughter of Magneto. And I'm not too sure how the film is going to go with them not being the son and daughter of Magneto as two different companies own the rights to the Avengers and the X-Men films. Then we've got what I'm personally looking forward to Jurassic World. It's been a good 10 years plus waiting for this film. And I hope it doesn't disappoint me. Film itself, from what I can see from the trailer, looks like it's going to be a nice little homage to the originals, but bringing over their own new stuff in. And from what I can see is that they don't have any of the original cast. But it looks. I still think it will be a good, good film, to be honest. And then finally, if I didn't put this in, a friend of mine would actually kill me. Uh, it is Star Wars: The Force Awakens, and I've seen the trailer. It looks brilliant. This film looks like it can bring new fans into the the fold of the Star Wars universe. Uh, them that have liked the classics, and them that like newer stuff. Me, personally, I like the classics. The newer stuff doesn't really interest me as well as the originals did. The originals were more about the story. And as a honourable mention, I'll say, as those were my top five, an honourable mention I will give to the Fantastic Four. It's set to come out this year, but there's been no posters, there's been no trailer there's been no talk about it but me personally i'm looking forward to seeing the reboot of it i'm um, me personally i'm not too sure about dr doom on it but we'll see what comes out and i'd like to know what you guys are looking forward to are you the same as me you're looking forward to these films or is there a film i haven't mentioned that you guys are looking forward to leave a comment below and remember be good and if you can't be good, don't get caught. Cool.